Hey, it's Jacarius, aka the Soap at the Show, and I'm here to give you a review of today's episode, Days of Our Lives, which is Martha Martin Luther King's Day. And yeah, happy birthday to this man itself. I have a dream itself. So yeah, we we'll always be my favorite quote for him. So yeah. So let's get this started. So we see Paulina, Chanel, and Abe at the pub. And yeah, they are thrilled to have so many people beautifying the town of Martin Luther King Day of Service. Join them in the British pub apron. Johnny hands out coffee. And yeah, Chanel follows Johnny back where he was. And yeah. Back inside, where she worries about Paulina Bosby resource, and yeah, um, I'm just so afraid what they're gonna do with the Paulina character at this point. And also, oh, I need for Jenny to get him a job too. It's time for Jenny to get him a job. The stay is sitting around like, what, what happens to him being a filmmaker and all these type of things? Yeah. But pretty much, then we see outside the cold approaches Abe and Paulina, and she shares that Holly is going to um, Italy for treatment. So yeah, and I'm just trying to figure out is Nicole is, is Nicole really leaving? Cause we heard rumors about uh, Nicole leaving the show, and yeah, and I believe that's that could be her exit. So, yeah. And moving on, we see Chad and Everett pick up trash at the park. And yeah, Everett struggles to come up with words. And yeah. And I think he's lying about his coma. Or he could be having split personality or something. He talked about he's he getting this spell and he just needs to eat. So, yeah. Whew. I don't, I don't really care about the storyline, but I don't want to say the race. So we see Leo and at boats to Sloan at the square. The head stuck to a budget. Describe, I mean, despite her denying three three requests for more money, and yeah, he literally blackmailed Sloan, and <laughs> Sloan, you're just gonna be broke at this point, cause. Leo is is getting at all your money, <laughs> and I'm not I'm not gonna be sorry for you. So yeah, but we see Nicole approach Stone after she asked him about Jude, and Nicole shares that Holly like could be going to Italy for a treatment, and Sloan's talking about she be praying for them. Oh, uh, you you got her baby, and she don't even know. And yeah, I can wait for all this mess. To, uh, to be revealed. So yeah. And Sloan explains to Nicole she's out getting dinner for John Malena. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And well, I just don't care about the scenes. And yeah, I just can't. Cause I'm just ready for this truth to come out. Even though I can't feel sorry for Nicole. I don't feel sorry for her. But at the same time, I don't feel like I I feel like she Oh my god, I don't wanna say this but <laughs> she's in every corner. And yeah. And the and Nicole just uh, need a race at this point. They just need to take Nicole somewhere and yeah. I just can't bear to see all this stuff. And I'm trying, trying not to feel bad, but at the same time, I, oh my God, I feel bad for the, for the woman. So yeah. And, whew, wow. <laughs> then we see the car recovering, eating a protein at the newsroom, and yeah. I just can't. 
I just don't really care about the storyline. It just, ooh, I'm sorry for my tongue being tied, but I just don't know what to think at this point. Yeah, I'm, I'm just reading just the recaps. Sorry, I know what happened on today's episode, and now I do know what happened on today's episode. But you gotta give, give my brain back, but yeah, just, just let's focus on talking about the review. Yeah. Pretty much. <laughs> and all I got to say is just every, every, every. Do we really know? Do we really know who, like, every is really is? Because, yeah, we have not seen him share scenes with, uh, Jada or anything like what is he all about I'm just still trying to figure out what is this uh, every character is all about and that's all I want to know <laughs> so yeah and wow then we see um, Sh uh, Johnny Chanel then Rafe and Jada talking about all these type of things that happen and stuff. So yeah, and like, like I love the conversation. I really do love that conversation that all the couples had, which is a good episode. I like, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. It's like the icing on the cake. And that's my lies is just, like, the episode was, like, better than today's episode of General Hospital, in my opinion. So, yeah. But, like, today's episode, days was so amazing. And, like, wow. They was, um, uh, they was, like, talking about Martin Luther King. Dr. Martin Luther King. And, yeah. And Jada... Reveals that some girl touched her hair and all these type of things. Like, wow, they really talking about real stuff. Like, I just, I really love it. That was so great. And yeah. Oh my God, but prior to that, uh, at the foster, they have the, cop, the cops calling on her. Uh, for stealing in the store. Jada is enters the pub with Rafe and worries how she's going to get back to work. But Rafe assures her that everything is going to be okay. They stop for a meal for after a rough day. And yeah, she talked about she should have uh, took a day off since it is a holiday. So yeah. And yeah, she always works this holiday to honor what Dr. King stood for, service for others. Yeah. And Johnny hands break for Jada's menus, explaining he's had his grandma, um, grandpa warmer since Tate is not around. And yeah, Chanel offers sweet bits, donuts, since she had a bad morning, and Jada herself. Yeah. And yeah. And Jada brings it to Rafe that people will advise Dr. King will want her to shrug out what happened and push forward. And yeah. And Jay and Jenna asked Chanel if she had been profiled like Jada was. And yeah. Jay said, like, are you kidding? And yeah. They was, uh they was talking about all these things like a lady clutch her purse when she walking walking in by the square, and Johnny never seen it. He's with her, and Chanel uh, points out he's not looking for it, but it happens everywhere, even in Italy. People were looking at them for being an interracial couple, and I said, "Wow, wow, I love it. I like it. whoever wrote this did an awesome job." Like, applause to them. 
And Rafe t talks about he recounts being profiled in the story because of his last name. And Jada can't relate, which I which I mention again, like and I will. She talked about uh but Lisa's hair isn't holding, yeah. She cautioned it over and they talking about um pe people wanting them to touch their hair and yeah. And Johnny serves them food and Jada recalls her mom not being drilled. Her first husband, husband was a white Jewish guy. And yeah, I like how they tackle these issues. And Jesh just needs to do better. And look what Days of My Life is doing. And Johnny brings up the love case about banning into a couple and lying them who to marry outside their race. And yeah. And Chanel also points out uh, whoever didn't include same-sex cover and yeah, being a black woman who's bisexual and I'm one of them myself and yeah, but I'm a guy, but in a guy perspective, so yeah, but she's talking about being a black woman who's also bisexual, stop labeling it herself because it's exhausting being so many types of other Jada thinks not acknowledge it. It is exhausting. So yeah. No, so that is pretty much it on these things. And Paulina accepts a offer to accompany her by speed with a uh, resource. Yeah. So she begins her podcast with a James Barber quotes. And she calls her when she starts to speak, and A jumps in and finishes with her. So, yeah. And Johnny talks about, tells Rafe how he outlaws out him as a kid. And remember, Rafe was Johnny's stepdad when he was married to Sammy. And I like how they brought that up. Because I actually like Rafe, Rafe and Sammy together. Yeah, and as much as I like Lucas and Sammy, I like Rafe and Sammy. I mean, Rafe and Sammy too. So, yeah. And I need John to get a job still. If I tear it, ain't gonna work, but I still leave you to get your job. So, yeah. Uh, and Paulina finished her podcast about expanding her equality and inclusion should not be controversial. And she said, we all want the same things in life. We should open our hearts and our minds and continue to do hard work for a better place to live in. And that's it on today's episode. So please like, comment, and subscribe. But don't forget to hit that bell. Follow me on Instagram slash threads at the soap at the show. And also subscribe to my main channel at Jacarius Does Things. And also follow me, follow me on Twitter at Soap at Show Team Journal 9 Day Stand 9 from all these things. And also follow me on Janelle Forever from all of Janelle content. And also follow Team John DeMero on Instagram for more all of Carson slash John DeMero content too. So yeah. But thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day, night, where you at? And I need to upload this by fast. And bye.